Hi, I'm Sperry Hutchinson, and if you're towing a trailer with your Honda Pilot, you're going to need trailer lighting. Now, what I've got here is a custom wiring connector that's going to adapt and allow you to hook the Honda Pilot wiring up to your trailer lighting system using a four-way flat connector to a vehicle harness adapter. So let's get to it. You will need the tool seen here to complete this installation. Honda made it really easy for those of us that are going to be adding trailer wiring by having a uh, harness uh, that's built to adapt trailer wiring and it's behind this driver's side quarter panel and we're going to need access to that. So first we're going to start by removing some of the trim here in the back. This stuff plate simply lifts up and out of the way to then gain access to these tie down points because behind here you're going to see some hardware. Here I've got an eight millimeter bolt. Just that easily set it aside. Now there's another behind this tie down, a little escutcheon that we're going to have to gain access by popping that down and out of the way. And now we can remove the Phillips head screw that's anchoring that tie down. Again, set that aside. We'll pull our weather strip just off the edge of that pinch weld here. We're gonna remove our panel that has our jack and tool set behind it. And simply pull with your hand and this will pop this panel loose enough from the vehicle. We also need to remove this small trim panel in the center of this quarter panel. We're gonna set our harness here on our floor mat and taking the, uh, we'll leave our four-way flat end here. We're gonna take our vehicle adapter and ground wire lead end of the harness, routing it through the jack compartment and up behind this panel. And we'll show you where we're going to connect that to the vehicle harness that is back and mounted here on this panel. I've got the harness and I'm gonna bring it up and it's keyed, you'll notice, so that it indexes only one way and snaps directly into the vehicle harness there. That connection's made. Now we're going to take our ground wire connection, which is this white wire with the eyelet on the end. And we're gonna find a mounting point that looks like we can use these 10 millimeter bolts already existing on the vehicle. So let's put that underneath those. Okay, so I've got a 10 millimeter socket that I'm going to remove this bolt. Place the ground wire eyelet beneath. I'm going to start this by hand just to make sure it gets started correctly. We're going to snug that right back up. And install our inline fuse, which is a 10 amp blade type fuse. This is actually powering the converter that was a part of this harness, that black box you see, that is creating our tail and brake light signals from the vehicle harness. Now that we have our 10 amp blade fuse installed back here on our harness, there's one more fuse that is included in this kit. It's this 30 amp uh, fuse and we're going to install that under hood on our Honda Pilot. So our under hood fuse box is here next to our master cylinder 
we're going to take our 30 amp fuse. You'll see the blades align with these two blades. We plug it in right here next to our uh, main lead coming in and reinstall the cover and that's that. All right, we're at the back of the vehicle again because I want to show you how, when in use, this harness will route out the back door of your pilot. You want to keep the wiring away from the latch mechanism and we're going to simply close the door and this will then connect to your trailer lead and when we open the hatch you'll see the wiring actually it doesn't get damaged there's enough give in the weather stripping to allow for a, a happy life uh, this way all right with our ground wire connection made our fuse in place and our harness installed we're going to take this uh, adapter uh, box and tuck it back here out of the way behind our jack and we have our our four-way lead i'm going to just put this dust cover on to keep the the four-way flat lead nice and clean and when we're towing a trailer we're simply going to take the lead out through the hatch and close it using it uh, to connect to the trailer then when it's not in use we're going to simply coil the lead up and stow it here in the jack compartment where it's safe and out of the way from cargo and now we simply begin by replacing our our panels put our tie downs back in place. Use our eight millimeter socket to replace our bolt up top here. There we go. Replace our trim panel there, as well as our jack compartment cover. And we'll get our scuff plate back in place. All of that snaps back in place. Get our weather stripping back where it needs to be along the edge. And remember to push this weather stripping back in along the pinch weld here so that your door and rear cargo hatch closes happily. That is it for the trailer wiring install. To learn more about the product seen in this video or to schedule an installation by U-Haul Hitch Professional, visit us online today at uhaulhitches.com.